Hello, uh, this question is about filtration. The question is, the filtration equation for filtration at constant pressure of 10 kPa is equal to this uh, equation, where T is in second and V in cubic meter. The specific resistance of the cake alpha is independent of pressure. If the filtration is run at constant rate of 1 liter per second, how long will it take to reach delta P equal to 120 kPa? Okay? So, you first need to write the filtration equation for the constant pressure, okay, uh, and that is equal to T divided by V equal to mu alpha Cs divided by 2 A2 delta P times V plus mu Rm divided by A delta P, okay. And the equation given in the question is T divided by V equal to 4 times 10 to the power of 3 times V plus 2. So if you compare these two equations, you can conclude that this coefficient should be equal to that and this term should be equal to 2. Therefore, mu alpha Cs divided by 2A2 two two, instead of delta P, I plug here 10 kPa, that is given in the question, times 10 to 10 kPa should be equal to this coefficient, that is 4 times 10 to the power of 3. From this one, you can conclude that mu alpha Cs divided by A2 is equal to 8 times 10 to the power of 7. So the same is valid here. You can write basically mu Rm divided by A in a set of delta P. I put 10 kilopascal should be equal to 2. Therefore, mu, uh, therefore mu Rm divided by A should be equal to 2 times uh, 10 to the power of 4, okay, 2 times 10 to the power of 4, okay, so yeah, now you have these two uh, expressions, and so this, the question is, how long, uh, if the filtration is run at constant rate pressure, uh, co co const, sorry, constant rate of 1 liter per second, how long will it take to reach the delta P equal to 100? 120 kilopascal. So here for this part, you need to write the filtration equation on the constant rate condition. That is delta P is equal to mu alpha Cs divided by A square times dV over dt times V plus mu Rm divided by A dV over dt. Okay, so the good news here is the quantities you calculated in the previous section here, mu alpha Cs over A2, you can you basically have this value, and also here mu Rm over A, you have this value. So basically, I just need to substitute those values into this equation. So uh, the question is, how long does it take to have, to reach the delta P equal to 120 kilopascal? So here I can write 120 kilopascal equal to in a set of this term. I put the value calculated in the previous section, that is 8 times 10 to the power of 7. In a set of dV over dt, the rate is given, that is 1 liter per second, which will be uh, 10 to the minus 3 cubic meter per second, right? Times V plus mu RMA is already given based on the previous calculation, that will be 2 times 10 to the power of 4, times dV over dt, that is 10 to the minus 3. So if you solve this equation, you will obtain V, the volume of the the volume equal to one and a half cubic meter okay so we know the rate the rate of filtration is 10 to the minus 3 okay so the rate is 10 to the minus 3 therefore the time required to collect this much will be equal to one and a half divided by 10 to the minus 3 which will be equal to 1500 seconds and that's the solution to this question